On November 4, 2024, the U.S. State Department approved a potential foreign military sale to South Korea, valued at approximately $4.92 billion. This deal will see the purchase of four Boeing E-7 Wedgetail Airborne Early Warning and Control AWNC aircraft and related logistic support. The acquisition aims to enhance South Korea's intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance ISR capabilities while improving interoperability with U.S. forces through strengthened command, control, communications, computers, intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance C4 ISR systems. South Korea currently operates four Boeing 737-based E-7AWNC aircraft, locally known as PSI, which were acquired between 2011 and 2012. These aircraft, equipped with Northrop Grumman's electronically scanned radar, provide South Korea with 360-degree air and maritime surveillance, playing a vital role in the country's surveillance and airborne control architecture. The E-7's capabilities are crucial for monitoring airspace and supporting air defense, especially in light of North Korea's increasing missile tests in recent years. The latest acquisition request includes a wide range of equipment to support the new E-7 aircraft. This includes 10 CFM-56 jet engines, 7 Guardian laser transmitter assemblies, 8 and slash AAR-57 and slash AQ-24, VN large aircraft infrared countermeasures, LARCM, system processor replacements, and 10 embedded global positioning system slash inertial navigation systems. Additional support equipment includes radios, radar warning receivers, electronic countermeasure dispensers, and various communication and security systems, ensuring the operational readiness of the new aircraft. Beyond equipment, the sale includes comprehensive logistical support, such as spare parts, training aids, technical documentation, and engineering services. It also covers personnel training, aircraft transportation, and ongoing maintenance support, all facilitated by U.S. government and contractor services. This move aligns with South Korea's goal of reducing its dependence on U.S. forces for aerial surveillance and strengthening its independent ISR capabilities. The E-7 aircraft will be crucial for monitoring the Korean Peninsula, enhancing South Korea's ability to detect and track potential threats, and contributing to its overall defense posture. The acquisition is part of a broader initiative to expand South Korea's AWNC fleet. In 2023, South Korea announced a competitive program, evaluating the Boeing E-7, Saab Global I, and an L-3 Harris Gulfstream-based variant for additional purchases. With this latest approval, South Korea is set to bolster its regional airspace security and improve its capability to address evolving security challenges in the region.